In this PowerPoint presentation, our group will be discussing the controversial case of Lemon versus Kurtzman. The plaintiff of the case was Lemon and the defendant was Kurtzman. Now let's learn more about the case. The U.S. Supreme Court asked for God's blessing on the court. U.S. coins are embossed with In God We Trust. The trial of Lemon v. Kurtzman was a groundbreaking case that took place in Pennsylvania. The case began because the state of Pennsylvania passed a law that allowed the local government to use money to fund educational programs that taught religious-based lessons, activities, and studies. This law was passed through the Non-Public Elementary and Secondary Education Act of 1968 and represented through David Kurtzman. The case of Lemon v. Kurtzman was filed by Alton Lemon, a Pennsylvania instructor who claimed that Pennsylvania violated the First Amendment to the United States Constitution. And here we have the First Amendment to the United States Constitution, which states that Congress shall make no law respecting an establishment of religion or prohibiting the free exercise thereof or abridging the freedom of speech or of the press or of the right of the people peaceably to assemble and to petition the government for a redress of grievances. Lemon believed that Pennsylvania violated the First Amendment to the United States Constitution because the Constitution does not allow the establishment of any state laws or legislation that combine the interests of religious people with the interests of the state's population. The court considered some familiar questions on church-state relations. Did state assistance to private religious schools violate the Establishment Clause of the First Amendment? On the other hand, did withholding state assistance to private religious schools violate the First Amendment's Free Exercise Clause? Chief Justice Warren Berger spelled out a three-part test for judging the constitutionality of state aid to religious education. The government's action must have a secular legislative purpose, purpose prong. The government's action must not have the primary effect of either advancing or inhibiting religion, effect prong. The government's action must not result in an excessive government entanglement with religion, entanglement prong. In this case, the Supreme Court of the United States found that the passing of any state laws that establish a religious body is a direct violation of the United States Constitution. Therefore, the Supreme Court of the United States ruled in favor of Alton Lemon.